Watching this video will probably make you never edit a photo manually again. Look at this photo before the edit. And now the same photo after editing with Fodor. Did you see the difference? Now let me tell you how this amazing transformation happens with just a few words. Because after days of searching for the best AI photo editing tool, I finally found one that completely eliminates the manual editing process. In this video, I'll show you exactly how you can edit your photos with just a few sentences and instantly turn them into whatever you want. From Pixar style posters to clean and professional edits without knowing even the smallest thing about photo editing. For this video, we're using a tool called Fodor, and specifically, we're going to test its new feature, Fodor AI Agent. If you'd like to follow along with this tutorial, I've placed its link in the description section. And believe me, this is really one of the first tools I've seen that removes manual work entirely from the editing process. Instead of clicking here and there, dragging sliders, or opening 100 menus, you just describe how you want the photo to look, and it does the rest like magic. I'll show you exactly how to write prompts to get the best results from AI. Then with just a few simple words, we'll edit some of my own photos, and I'll introduce you to some of its coolest built-in features. Okay, when you sign up on Fodor, you'll see this kind of homepage. On the left side, you need to select the AI Agent option. It's right at the bottom of the page. When you click on it, the prompt window will open. Here you have a section to write the changes you want the AI to make on your photo, and also an option to upload the photo you actually want to edit. For me, I'll just put a random photo of myself, like this one you see here. And for editing, I wanted something simple. For example, changing the hairstyle. This brings me to a very important point about prompt writing to get the best results from this tool. There are three things you need to know about writing prompts in Fodor. First, you need to be specific and precise in your edits. That means telling the AI exactly what you want to change. So instead of just writing, make me smile, you should write, change the facial expression to a gentle closed smile without showing teeth. This alone makes the output much better. Second, tell it what needs to stay the same. Be clear about which parts should not be changed, because if you don't say so, the AI might change them by default. Third, keep it short. A few clear and precise sentences are enough, not a long essay. Now, if all this sounds a bit complicated, I've actually created a prompt template that you can directly enter into ChatGPT. It has brackets where you just put your general idea and then ChatGPT returns a structured and complete prompt that follows all the rules. I've placed the link for this right below the Fodor link in the description. Now, when I go back to the prompt window in Fodor, I paste my prompt inside, hit enter, and send it to the AI. Now, Fodor processes it, and when it's done, Done, it gives you the edited image. Okay, the processing is complete. Let's see. As you can see, the photo is exactly the same as the previous one. The face is still the same. I'm still the same person in the photo, but now I have a completely different hairstyle. And what's even cooler is that the hairstyle has blended very naturally with my head and face. So I think this is a big win for Fodor. But Fodor can do much more than simple photo edits. Now we want to change the entire style of the photo. For this, I'll choose a completely different photo of myself. And what I want the AI to do is turn the style of the photo into a 3D cartoon look, but keep all the other parts of the photo exactly the same. Again, I use the ChatGPT prompt template. I've already written the prompt, so I just paste it into Fodor's prompt window, send it, and wait for the result. Okay, now that the photo is back, let's take a look. As you can see, the whole photo hasn't changed, except for the style of my face. And this is really impressive, even compared to some professional software. Okay, now let's get into the cooler parts. Right now, I want to make a 3x3 grid, meaning nine different versions of one person side by side. For this, I'll go to AI Agent. To do this, I simply type this prompt. Then, I hit the Generate button. The result? A stunning animated 3x3 photo layout that looks professional, creative, and instantly grabs attention. Each frame shows a new background while everything stays visual visually consistent in lighting and tone. This kind of visual would normally take hours to create manually, but now it's done automatically with just one simple prompt. What's even more impressive is how naturally it arranges the faces. There's no weird distortion or blending. It actually looks like a professional collage made by hand. 
but let's go one step further. I choose one of these photos and go to the animate photo section. All I need to do is click on the uploaded photo, select one of the animations, and hit generate. This grid plus animation combo really shows that Fodor is not just a simple editor, but it can turn your ordinary photos into something truly attractive and professional. Now, Fodor even has a voice input option. That means you don't even need to type your prompts anymore. Let me show you how it works. I go back to the AI agent section, and right next to the prompt window, I see a small voice icon. When I click on it, voice recording activates and I can directly speak my edit request to the AI. Let's try this with a new photo. I upload a photo of a girl holding a croissant, and instead of typing, I say my prompt. Can you remove the croissant from her hand and put her hand down? As you can see, it automatically converts my speech into text. And now, the same girl is there, with her hand down and no croissant. And now, you've learned how you can completely change your photos with just one sentence and get results that really look real. And with Photor, this is quick, easy, and free to try. Another very valuable feature of Fodor is its built-in editing tools. To access them, just click on a photo generated by the AI. Once inside, click on the edit button in the center bottom. This opens a full editing suite where you can do many more things. You can enhance photo quality, magically remove objects, retouch skin, sharpen blurry faces, and many other tools listed on the left. Now let's quickly talk about pricing, because I know you're probably thinking about it. Fodor actually has a generous free plan that lets you try these AI features we covered. Basic editing tools, some design templates, and even a limited number of credits for generative AI features are all completely free. If you want to unlock the full power of what I showed you, the pro plan gives you advanced AI tools, 100 monthly credits for AI-generated content, HD downloads without watermark, and access to over 100,000 premium templates. And if you want to do this professionally or in high volume, the Pro Plus plan upgrades you to 300 monthly AI credits, adds batch editing for up to 50 photos, and gives you branding kits for consistent styling. So if you want to edit your photos just by typing, sign up on Fodor right now and try it for free using the link I've placed in the description. Here's the good news. We've also prepared two one-month premium accounts for you. All you need to do is leave a comment under this video to enter the giveaway. And remember, Fodor is not just a simple editor. It's a complete platform with thousands of ready-made templates, and professional design tools that can transform your entire creative process. So go ahead and try it now, and write in the comments what's the first thing you'd like to create or change with Fodor.